In this video, we're drawing a one line wonder. Hey everyone, welcome to another Monty Plunkett art class where we use simple tricks to make fantastic picks. All you need are some colouring pens, pencils or crayons and some plain paper. Hmm, one line wonder. One line wonders are where we draw a picture but with a tricky twist. We must draw the entire picture in a single line. In this video, I'll be drawing a teddy bear. So I'm going to use a brown. Okay, I'm going to start from the bottom here and I'm going to go around to create the head of my teddy bear and I'm going to go around again and then up, wave either side, then up, in fact I'm just going to colour in the nose there. Ooh. <laughs> I think I'm there. And then I'm going to pop in one of the eyes there. I'm going to pop in another one there. All right. That's <laughs> just about made it. Right, let's pop an ear on. There we go. And the background. Oh, my goodness. Bend it round again. There we are. Right, that's quite straightforward. Ooh, went over the line a little bit there. That's okay. Now I'm going to bend down to create one of the arms. That looks a bit short. And then, in fact, I'm going to come down. My teddy is going to be my teddy bear is going to be sat down. So I'm sort of going to bend a leg around here. Uh, I'm not sure about the perspective at all with this one. But I'm not too worried about it. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> I can't see. I'm trying to look where the other side is, where the arm of our teddy bear is. What, what have we got? You sort of have to move the your pen or your pencil crane out of the way to actually see what you've created. There we go. I'm going to create sort of the soles of the feet. Uh, I've gone over. Again, I don't mind. I'm speeding up a little bit. Maybe I'll slow down. I'm going around the lines again. No, I'm going to go around here just to fill in a bit of the detail. That's not too bad. Let's create a couple of lines there. See, if I want to get over to the other side, I have to go right the way around. Create more lines. There we go. You happy with that? We draw a our teddy bear. Then we're going to finish on the nose. In fact, what I'm going to do is just come up to the top here and go back around those ears because I've been going over the other line so many times. And there we are, our teddy bear. This teddy bear's legs look a little bit thin. <laughs> they sort of pop out a bit. So let's add some colour. I'm going to colour in the eyes. I'm going to try to keep a little bit of white in the centre for the pupil. Pop in bit of colour for the ears. I'm going to use that same colour for the paws. Feel free to colour in your teddy bear in full if you wish to do so. This is just a quicker way that I use for these videos that creates a bit more definition without spending too long colouring in the whole picture. I'm going to put a t-shirt and some shorts on this teddy bear, I think. We've got our red t-shirt. I'm going to add, hmm, what colour shall I choose? Yellow? It's a Monteplunker teddy bear. Yay! <laughs> Let's add some shorts. Just going to add a bit of brown around the edges, just to define the borders a little bit. I'm going to add a few dashes on the arms and the legs for our teddy bear's fur and a 
a few on the head as well. If it's a Monty Plonka teddy bear, I think we need to add a little Monty Plonka logo, don't we? Maybe similar to this one up here. So where is our teddy bear? Where is it sat? Looks happy. Should we fill out some details? What about a picnic? Oh, that's a good idea. I'm gonna add a green line here to define the grass. Add a few dashes for the grass. Maybe we can pop the sandwich in this space here. This is the bread, a bit of cheese and some lettuce. Yum, 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 yum. Maybe a little bit of tomato as well. Let's cut it in half. It's going to be a little bit too big. Let's pop it on a plate. That's a funny shape plate. <laughs> Got quite a lot of sky up here. Just going to go around the edge of our grass scene and our teddy bear. And of course, we're going to have the sun out. I'm going to use two different colours for the sun, which is a fun, simple trick to use to give bit more definition. Just using a couple of colours really makes it pop off the paper in a different way. Got a bit of a section here, maybe I can add a few trees where our bear lives maybe in the woods. Add different colour greens similar to our sun to make it pop off a bit more. And there we have it, our teddy bear one line wonder. Come out the woods, grabbing a bit of sun, smile on their face, delicious sandwich, Mum, 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 mum. What a day. Yay! Thank you for joining this Monte Plonka art class. Please remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.